guys, so I just placed a big order with a bunch of natural and low toxin beauty products and bath and body facial products. Anyways, I decided to split it up into two separate hauls. The first one I did was all about nail products, Beauty Without Cruelty, that brand, and a little bit of chocolate. This one is going to be my haul of bath, body, facial moisturizing products. So if you'd like to see the other one, I'll put it down below in the description bar. And let's get started for this one. So first product I have, um, by the way, all this stuff is from LuckyVitamin.com. I'll link that below. Not sponsored anyway, but um, yeah, just wanted to let you guys know where I got it. We don't have a natural food store that's this local anymore, so getting stuff online. Anyways, so the first thing I got is this new toothpaste. I've been trying to search for like the perfect, um, you know, fluoride-free, no SLS uh, toothpaste, and I decided to try this one. It was on sale, LuckyVitamin.com, and I thought it would be a good time to try it. So this tube is three ounces. It's, um, you know, it's not a huge tube, but it was a pretty good deal. And um, ingredients here are vegetable glycerin, deionized water, PLU powder, titanium dioxide, xanthan gum, cultured maltodextrin, xylitol, natural oil of peppermint, and tea tree oil. So no SLS. So I was excited about that and the flavor or scent, I don't know what you call it, is peppermint. And I think my husband really likes peppermint, I know that. Um, but I think that tends to be like more of a safe flavor, I guess, to go with. So we'll see how this goes. It definitely seems... This isn't a very, oops, I was going to show you guys what it looks like from the tube here. It's not like one of those clear type toothpaste. Ooh, it seems kind of runny actually. Huh. If you guys want to see a review of this, leave a comment down below. Or if you've tried this, let me know. Yeah, it definitely seems more of a like thicker, I don't know if I'd say thicker, kind of like a runnier, pasty type toothpaste as far as um, other ones I've tried have been more like a gel. So that's interesting. And it does smell really pepperminty and really fresh. Next product is Now Solutions Grapeseed Oil. This is a 16 fluid ounce container. And this, I, this one I actually remember, I think it was on sale for $4.99 for this entire thing, which I thought was a really great, uh, really great deal. And this, it says the clear bottle contains UV light protectant. So it's supposed to help it from, you know, it's not gonna go rancid or the oil get damaged. And this you can use, it says suggested use, let me read this right off the bottle. As a natural moisturizer, apply oil directly to skin or use as base for lotions. And I'm thinking I'm going to use this for my facial scrub that I make. You can also use this just straight on to moisturize or for a massage. There's so many uses for grapeseed oil and I just thought I would try it out. I don't know what it is about this bottle, but something about the grapes and then the color of the actual product. It's just like really cool looking. I don't know, something cool about it. The next product is a brand that I actually had never heard of, but this is Dr. Woods Naturals. It is a daily exfoliating facial cleanser, and it says it's meant for all skin types, so it should be good there. Um, and it says it's an antioxidant formula with black soap and shea butter. So ingredients in here looked good, and this is an eight fluid ounce container. It seemed like for the quantity, this was a really good deal. Um, so I went with this. I do love my Acure Organics gel cleanser. Um, that's what I use every night, but I thought I would try something new. Um, and also because it's you know so big for the cost, it's a re really great deal and it's a lot cheaper. So I thought I would try it out. It does say it gently exfoliates, heals blemishes, neutralizes free radicals, moisturizes, and conditions. Let's see what this looks like. So it actually looks like like clear, like a soap, but it says it exfoliates. So I guess I'll have to try it out to see what it's like. And this definitely smells like essential oils. It smells like lavender, it smells like the peppermint, and I do get a little bit of tea tree oil in there too. And this is 100% natural, it's 100% vegan, paraben, phthalate free, no SLS, no petroleum, nothing like that. Second to last product is a deodorant. It is Leif's Organic Mother to Be Deodorant with Aloe Vera. And I would say that if there was a time in your life when you would wanna be you know, conscious of the things going on in your body, it would be when you're pregnant. And I think that's when I kind of started to really um, get into natural bath and body and makeup products. But the only ingredients for this are water, aloe vera extract, and mineral salts. So that's, you know, very, very pure and very natural. So I'm really curious to see how this is gonna work. Now it does have kind of like a spray type thing on the top. And I've never seen a deodorant like this, or at least never used one. So I'm interested to see how that's gonna work. And it does say it's 24 hour deodorant protection for the expectant mom free of chemicals harmful to your, to your baby. Of course, anybody can use this. You don't have to be pregnant to use it. Um, it's 93% certified organic, baby safe, 
and free of plastic. Um, and it also says, because what goes on your body goes into your body, and that is so true. No BPA, no phthalates, and no harmful chemicals. So we'll give this a try. It also says that 1% of their company profits go to support breast care awareness and prevention. So that's always cool too. I'm so curious to see how this works out. All right, the final product in my haul. This is a new daily essential moisturizer for normal skin. This is by Desert Essence. It's with jojoba and aloe vera. And there is this huge list down here. I don't know if you guys can read this. There's this huge list of all the things that it's yes and no. Yes, vegan. Yes, recyclable. Yes, gluten-free. <laughs> no petroleum. So many things that this is free of. I've seen a lot of products by Desert Essence, and I think I've only tried two. I think I've tried their shampoo and conditioner, that's all, and they were sample size. So, so far I've, I mean, I've liked their brand. Um, let's give this a sniff real quick. Let's see what this is like. So it doesn't have much of a scent, actually. Here's what it looks like. It's very white, and this feels kind of like a thicker, yeah, it's definitely like a thicker cream type uh, moisturizer, which I really like for nighttime. But this does say it's daily essential moisturizer, so I assume you could use this during the day. It'll be interesting to see if you can use this like underneath makeup or something like that. All right, guys, well, I hope you liked this portion of the haul video. If you'd like to see more videos like this or you just enjoyed this one, give me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to this natural beauty channel. That way you can be alerted to new videos coming up. And as always, my mom vlog channel. And if you guys have any questions, comments, put those down below. And I'll also have a link to the nail polish and beauty without cruelty haul that I did right before this. And I'll put a link to that down below. All right, guys, I'll see you later.